perhaps this story will help someone and perhaps there are people out there that can relate. I may be old in your eyes, but I still feel like I'm 21. I'm not finished yet. I started work at 14 and I'm 62 today. Yes, it's my birthday and I'm giving myself a chance because I deserve it. I'm not saying, ooh, look at me, I'm wonderful, in a big-headed, bragging kind of way. It's just that I've finally learned to love myself and I know what I'm worth. Yes, I'm different. And because of that, I've always been an outsider, even from my own flesh and blood. I've always been a fast learner and I can turn my hand to anything once shown how to do it. I've had to be in order to survive. I'm not as strong physically as I used to be, but that's okay, because I'm still willing. I've taken on so many jobs throughout my life, so as not to be unemployed and pay my bills. Most times I've managed that, but there have been times when I couldn't. This was never my choice, since circumstances have always dictated. I believe it was God's way of bringing me out of a situation and showing me another direction. Yes, I have O levels and A levels, but they mean nothing. My experience and learning have come through life and not from pieces of paper, titles and letters after my name. I've been a barmaid, a cocktail waitress, a silver service waitress in hotels and restaurants, a courier, a door-to-door -door salesperson, a recruitment consultant, an officer for invalidity and sickness benefit, an insurance clerk, a promotional salesperson, timeshare salesperson, pub grub cook, advertising salesperson, secretary, typist, administrator, data entry clerk, switchboard operator, assistant to a mayor, secretary to head of chamber of commerce, accounts assistant, errand girl, kitchen porter, estate agent, secretary to the European head of a credit card, administrator for a homeless hostel, receptionist, bookkeeper, sales administrator, credit controller, accounts assistant, interviewer, kitchen designer, sign writer and painter, gardener, dog walker, chambermaid, holiday rep, babysitter, cleaner, Payroll Clerk, Payroll Assistant, MOD Auditor Officer, Auditor, Budget and Admin Manager, Assistant Accountant, Management Accountant, Market Stallholder and Salesperson, Boot and Garage Salesperson, Sales Assistant, Banking Assistant, Engineers Assistant, Payroll Manager, HR Manager, HR Assistant, Sales and Purchase Ledger Assistant, Purchase Ledger Manager, Travel Operative Assistant, Writer, Translator, Proofreader, Article Writer, YouTube Video Maker and Video Editor. Yes, that's a lot of experience in a lot of different fields and industries. I speak four languages, including Yanito, and I've worked in four different European countries. Since lockdown, I've sent my CV to thousands of companies, most of whom never bother to even reply. I send hundreds of emails to job agencies that never come back with a response. And time and time again, I have to pick myself up by my bootstraps. I'm not saying this is poor me, I'm a victim. In fact, it's just the opposite. Look what I've been through and I'm still here. There's no point in wasting my time anymore, applying for jobs with companies and agencies that don't get back to me or even acknowledge me. I'm still here and I'm still moving forward. I'm a survivor. However, with all my experience and knowledge, I need help. I can make a great business and earn really good finance, but I need a chance. I can't do these things alone as it takes teamwork and finance to make a difference and help others, neither of which I have. Again, that is not to say poor me, but to ask for backers, like-minded folk, 
someone who believes in me and is willing to take a chance on me. I'm still here and I'm not finished yet.